All right, guys. Lock your fucking trucks. We got a thief break in, second time this week. Yeah, guys, so thief broke in again at my apartment complex. Second time this week, there's something going on. I know there's an inside job here. I don't know where, who, how. I think it's somebody just strolling through here, just fucking homeless guy strolling through here, breaking into trucks, popping into trucks, because I have my club on here, ripped the club completely fucking off, sprung over there. That's exactly how I found it, guys. Broke everything off. My, I have my kill switch on it, though, I'm telling y'all where it is, but kill switch goes. Fucking truck got broken into. Lock your fucking trucks, guys. Lock your trucks, lock your trucks, lock your trucks. And even if I locked it, I locked my truck, it still broke. They still broke into it easy peasy lemon squeezy i'm gonna have to make a fucking insurance claim or i'm just completely gonna cut this thing off cut this whole entire wire off right here and just completely replace the door handle and motor and try to just use the uh the key fob guys like the little key thing that you press you press pops all the locks open and everything but i'm gonna be showing you guys running down what i have because this is the second week time this week that this has been broken into and tried to been completely stolen and also the second time in the past or the fourth time in the past two months that my truck has been completely tried to be stolen um the cops are coming here and in the next two to three hours i have to go film a podcast and then i also have to film a video for relentless shine i mean this is just pathetic guys i hate these hate these hate these with a passion found out it was legal it is legal to shoot somebody if they break into your truck i that is the absolute last resort guys i would never ever want to shoot somebody ever absolute last resort but i i will definitely hold them hostage say hey get on the ground like i'm gonna shoot you like if you do not get on the fucking ground i mean this is just pathetic my apartment is literally right up there guys so like i could walk out on my balcony and witness this guy breaking into my truck like I didn't see him breaking into my truck, but I might start camping out here in the next couple of days just to see if I can witness this guy breaking into my trucks. The cops are not going to do anything, guys. Thieves do not get caught enough. They, it's so easy for them to break in. Like people can make a living literally just breaking into trucks. You, you gotta, we gotta hold these people accountable, man. And I, I know this whole entire channel is about Power Truck Central. This is about 7.3 content, and I know a fuckload of you guys out there have got this fucking problem. And I'm sorry, I'm ranting right now, but I'm fed up right now about thieves. I just hate them, hate them, hate them, hate them, hate them so much that I just, it's such a waste of time and it's money. I mean, it's going to cost me hundreds of dollars to get this fixed. It's not even worth making insurance claim because insurance is all fucked up right now in the U.S. And so it's going to cost me $500, $600 to get this whole entire thing fixed. And then I also got steering wheel leather that's all beat up and messed up because this guy ripped this thing off as hard as he could. The only thing that saved my truck, guys, was my kill switch. So I might be starting to try to sell these kill switches so that way you guys can protect your vehicles because I know every single one of you guys that watch my channel either owns a 7.3 or likes 7.3 content or one a 7.3. And this is the problems that you're going to have, guys, if you get a 7.3, you're going to have break-ins and break-ins a lot. I'm talking like weekly, monthly, and like we got to hold these people accountable, guys. Like I, I want to start a movement right now. Like, hey, if you see a thief, take action. Don't shoot them, obviously, but like, hey, man, get on the ground, call the cops, like make sure the cops aren't going to hardly do anything. You got to hold yourself accountable to like get these people down, take these people down. Like I am so fed up with it. It is just a pain in the ass. If you are a thief, you're at the bottom of the fucking barrel. I've never stolen anything ever. Maybe a donut from HEB now and then, but that's, I didn't even know I was stealing it i five years old taking a donut at hub i've never fucking stolen from anything ever in my life not even for walmart nothing i hate thieves with a passion if you have to steal to get your stuff you are a absolute bottom of the fucking barrel you do not deserve to like you do not deserve life like if you have to steal uh, uh, from other people you have to fuck people's day up you have to fuck people's life up if my truck would have gotten stolen guys that would have fucked my whole entire month up i mean i would have been eight ten nine ten grand in the hole i mean some people don't even have insurance like luckily i have insurance on this vehicle so i would have been able to actually i would have been able to cover this with insurance some people don't even have insurance guys so if you don't they don't even have insurance that could fuck their whole life up if you steal their car their whole entire life could be ruined money down the drain they won't we be able to feed their kids because they've been their shit's been stolen it's it's that kind of shit that just really pisses me off and and thieves really mess people's lives up i know some people personally who have gotten hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars of stuff stolen uh, trucks and trailers rigs my own landscaping company has gotten a full-blown trailer with 10 grand on it and trust me guys that was a huge setback because we didn't have any insurance on the lumber we had insurance on the trailer nothing on the lumber 10 grand in fucking lumber gone just like that so I mean, it's a huge fucking setback, not for me personally, because I'm going to be able to post this video. Luckily, I'm in a position now where, you know what I mean? If my truck gets stolen, it's I can make an insurance claim. You know, I'll get money back and I'll go buy a new 7.3, new content for y'all. But I put so much work into this, so much time into this truck. It's like, I don't want to sell it. I have 469,000 miles on this truck. This truck has been everywhere. This is like literally my blood, sweat, and tears in this truck. And I do not want it to be fucking stolen. Like, that's the last thing I want. You should be able to keep a truck, buy a truck, and have a truck. If you spend your hard-earned money on it, you should not have to fucking work 
worry about thieves. You should not have to worry about thieves. So yeah, I just wanted to rant on for you guys about that. I wanted to start a little movement. That's kind of the goal of posting this video. I was gonna post a video, a 7-3 transformation video, but I thought, hey man, thieves again broke into my truck. So I wanna make a video about this because it's the second time this week. I didn't make a video about the first one because it wasn't that bad. They didn't really break anything the first time, but this time they fucked my door lock up, guys. Like, look at this. I mean, they, they tore the whole thing out. Like, this is just pathetic. I mean, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. I'm gonna have to get, take an insurance claim out and, and then again, what, what's this gonna cost? $500? I'm gonna take an insurance claim out for $500. Now I gotta set back $500 fucking dollars for some thief who just wanted to come in here and get a quick fix and just try to get a quick truck. Luckily, I have the parameters to set up to where, guys, I'm set up to where it's hard for thieves to steal it with my kill switch. I, I do wanna show you guys it, my kill switch. I have my steering lock on right now because I just wanted to see if they would fuck my steering wheel up, but they didn't. As you guys can see, I got the key turned. It doesn't even need a key anymore because guess what? These broke the key out, so fuck them, but. He will clearly hear the horn there if they try to start it. I'm not telling y'all where the kill switch is because I don't know if it's somebody watching this goddamn channel that is breaking into my truck or not, but it's been two times this week and I will catch you if you break in again. Not around with that. So if you're watching this video and you've broken into my fucking truck, no mercy on the next one. I'm going to be fucking coming with vengeance. I'm going to have the cops on speed dial. I am not taught. I do not tolerate thieves. I'll be watching you from right there. If you are watching this video, you will be watched the whole time filmed, recorded with my 4k Sony camera. I will have you on video stealing into my truck or 1% chance I shoot you because as a last resort guys do not agree with murder. Do not agree with any of that. I believe thieves should be shot <laughs> if they are caught. I do think it should be legal. But nowadays with everything that's going on in America, if you shoot somebody, you are practically fucked. Like they got so many laws nowadays where if you shoot somebody like it's pretty much yeah guys right when i turn 21 i'm gonna start carrying a handgun get my ltc so that way i have a license to carry and if i catch you breaking into my fucking truck it will be over that is a message these should be dead if you have stolen i mean i'm not talking like you know an apple here and there from heb or like you know a fucking pack of gum three dollar items if you're breaking into somebody's personal vehicle stealing their own shit no you should not be able to do that like that you shouldn't you should be in jail or you should be dead that's where you belong because that is where you belong if you are a thief that is where you belong i just wanted to post this video real quick because i'm so fed up about it i've ranted this is probably the longest i've ranted because this has happened so much and it's within a span of a couple months that i've just been fucked like broken into twice i've had my dad replace my key fob twice i mean it's his time too guys like it, it fucking pains me to see him busting his ass on my truck trying to fucking fix the things that these thieves are up every time i've seen a lot of people out there f-150s f-250s get their shit broken into i mean i'm so done guys i'm so done so fed up with it if you ever catch a thief breaking into your truck guys 911 very first thing you do call 911 asap try to sit as an arrest them because if they hear you call 911 or they see 911 they're gonna bolt out of there get their description too make sure you get them on video make sure you get their description so that way if they see them around they can put a wanted out for them i'll have a spotlight 4k camera on your ass if you do break into this truck so but yeah that's it for this one if you guys want to watch some real 73 content some badass 73 content you guys need to watch it now because there might not be another video if we don't get this fucking issue resolved so to be up there or down there thank you guys for watching peace out fellas and have a nice rest of y'all today i hope you guys enjoy your day remember if you see a thief take them down that's my message for y'all peace out